Hi there everyone, I'm Laurie Black and I'm a specialist here at Whiskey and Rum Auctioneer as well as working in the customer relations department. We're really excited to share our knowledge and our enthusiasm and our experience of the whiskey industry, the rum industry and of course the auction industry with yourselves as well. We understand that some of you might be new to whiskey, new to rum, new to collecting um, but we are here to help you every step of the way. Step number one of selling a cask at auction is valuation. Uh, we have a team of experts here at Whiskey and Rum Auctioneer who can review previous auction results to give you an accurate estimate of what your cask might sell for at auction. This is based primarily on the regauge information, so the number of litres left in the cask and the strength, as well as distillery, vintage and cask type as well. Second stage is verification, so we will ask you for proof of ownership as well as asking for information as to the location of the cask, as well as uh, details of storage fees and any insurance charges, which will then become the responsibility of the new buyer. The third stage is the auction itself. This is where your cask will be offered at auction to our international network of buyers and investors. Our listing team will provide a lot description, providing full details of the cask, and our marketing team will work behind the scenes to promote your cask through newsletters, social media and other paid advertising. Setting a reserve is optional um, when you offer your cask at auction. For those that don't know, a reserve is just a guarantee that your cask will not sell for less than a certain amount. Sometimes this can provide a useful safety net, on other occasions it can deter some bidders from getting involved. Again, our customer service team can advise as to whether a reserve would be appropriate or not appropriate. The fourth step is transfer of ownership and this happens after the auction and once Whiskey and Rum Auctioneer have collected payment from the buyer. We will create a legal document known as a delivery order which needs to be signed for by the seller of the cask as well as the buyer also. Once this has been completed and all necessary admin fees have been paid, we will then pass this on to the distillery or the warehouse to complete the transfer of ownership. The fifth and final stage is payment. So once we are satisfied with the transfer of ownership, we will make payment into the seller's bank account within 21 business days. Throughout this whole process, we will keep the seller and the buyer informed of all developments. Okay, that's been a whistle-stop tour of our guide to selling whiskey casks at auction. If you have any questions about anything, please don't hesitate to give us a call or get in touch.